took four matches for Northern to uh, take you guys. Uh, talk a little bit about that game. Well, you know, it's uh, it was a frustrating match uh, last night, but at the same time, it's the first time we've had uh, our regular rotation back on the floor in uh, two weeks since uh, the injuries all hit, and it was uh, it probably wasn't uh, what we uh, had hoped for, but maybe more what we expected. Uh, trying to get everybody back in sync, back in timing. Uh, Northern played an exceptional game defensively, uh, and you know, truthfully, we we uh, we attacked way too much from the outside. Didn't get our other hitters involved, but that's been typically what we've had to do uh, here in this whole two-week period with uh, the injuries. So we got we got to get back to spreading the ball out now that we I think we're getting everybody back to health. What are you doing this week to uh, get uh, your team back to hit in the middle? Uh, what we do is just get back into practice and uh, just force it uh, and. It's not so much that we don't have the ability to get it back to the middle. It's just that uh, they're, you know, going into last night's match, maybe uh, it was a, we didn't have a lot of a lot of confidence in in changing immediately what we needed to do. Uh, we did put it in the middle a couple of times, didn't have much results, and that wasn't a, a fact that the kid the kids weren't uh, don't have the ability to. It's just that uh, two weeks out of that rotation is a long time. So, does how long do you think it uh, takes for that chemistry and that timing to come back after two weeks? Well, I think we started to see it a little bit last night. Uh, game one wasn't real good. Game two, uh, you know, maybe we saw a little improvements, but game three, we uh, we started to uh, get 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 back to the feeling normal. Uh, played a pretty good game three. Had a really good game four with uh, both teams. Played a really good, solid game four. Uh, and they have a quality team, and uh, that makes it difficult when when you're trying to get back to normal. We offer our kids no excuses over that. Uh, we have enough good players, uh, enough quality athletes to go out and win that match if, if we don't make some, uh, some mistakes coming down the stretch each game. Game three was the game that you took. Uh, was there something uh, different that they, uh, that, that they did, or were you guys just executing better? I think it was execution uh, on our side. Uh, we, got probably, we, we did a much better job of getting balls down. Uh, we had 75 swing attempts from the outside last night, which is way too many, and that, that's – that's a big factor, and I, I thought they got to load. They load their blockers up a little bit on the outside, and uh, you know, timing and, and confidence, uh, not being in the gym together, and you know, with that rotation, probably is a factor in the confidence side of it. But you know, we have two really good workouts here before we get to go to little bit, and hopefully, we'll continue to see improvement from what we saw from game one to game four last night. Hopefully, we can see some more improvement and, and start getting ready for this. You got Lebet Thursday. Thursday night we go. We travel to Parsons, uh, play Lebet. Uh, it's a team that continues to play better and better. Uh, it's another challenge, but uh, we're excited about it. You uh, faced Lebet at uh, Coffeeville not long ago. We did. And uh, do you expect how you took five matches? You guys came out of that? Yeah, that? yeah, that went five games, and that was with the uh, rota- That was with uh, an abnormal, what we call an abnormal rotation. Uh, but we did. We played. Uh, we played really well, three, four, and five. Uh, and you know, we we played them earlier in the season at our place with our normal rotation. And beat them in uh, four. So they, they've got a decent little group there. That uh, they have some good attackers in the middle. Uh, they really like to load up the middles, and uh, we're going to be able to take their middle out of it. And if we can do that, uh, we can get back in, back on track here. Is the middle their strength? I think the middle's their strength. They have a, a really nice middle attacker. Uh, sets the sets seem to be real slow. She likes to bring a lot of arm, and they have a they have a pretty good outside uh, attacker as well that uh, we seem to have controlled uh, last time we played them. Uh, it's just a matter of us really playing clean uh, and, and getting our execution back down. Thank you, Coach. Good luck. Thank you.